top yard. <laughs> yeah. So I'll just let y'all guys know this is my first time on stage. So uh, I'm a virgin on stage. Yeah. I'm about to pop that chair tonight. But no, nah, I'm feeling good. It's not the alcohol, I promise you. But I'm feeling good. The reason I'm feeling good is because I um, got a chance to spend some time with my fam that I haven't seen in, in some in a few years. And uh, so the last few weeks, I spent some time with them. And the more I got to spend some time with them, it just hit me. Have you ever have anyone in your family that every time you see them, like the first thing that you say to yourself, you're like, oh, hell no, nah, man, not again. <laughs> That's my family, you know what I'm saying? Every one of my family, I was doing something stupid, like some oddball bullshit. Everyone, like my Uncle Mike. Now, my Uncle Mike, he is the type of uncle that will like show up at a party or a family reunion loud and drunk. That's my uncle all the way. He's loud as shit. You can hear his ass a mile away. It always crack me up when I see somebody trying to talk to my uncle. And if they try to talk like have like a serious ass conversation. Good luck with that shit, you never had never gonna be able to talk to him. Cause he had this habit of, maybe you know someone like this. He has this habit of asking you a question and answering at the same damn time. <laughs> all the time. You know what I'm saying? He's like, hey! How old you know, boy? 15? Why are you crying and holding your stomach like that? Your stomach hurting? Which big head cuz you gotta fight with now? Peanut? Hey! <laughs> Who preaching tonight? Pastor Johnson? <laughs> Jim? What the hell is in your head, girl? Is that weed? Billy? Why are you walking the hallway on your, on your ass like that? You shitting on yourself again? <laughs> Why is that nobody in this goddamn house ain't answering my goddamn questions? <laughs> that got your tongue? That's my goofy ass Uncle Mike. I am an Uncle Mike. But, but I feel like he does that shit all the time. No, he always does some all ball shit. Do some shit that I don't understand. Like he told me that he's writing this book about saving marriages. His ass is single and been divorced seven damn times. <laughs> that shit I don't understand. To be continued on that bullshit. But I said I feel like he does this shit just to just to mess with the family. He does that at everyone, except for my grandma before she passed away. Now, he never done that because he was scared of shit of her. As a matter of fact, we all was afraid of my grandma. And like she would do the craziest things too, like some all ball shit. So we was all afraid of her. Like since this day, I don't understand why she did it. But she used to be, true story, she used to be in the middle of the, in the, in the living room, half ass naked, eyeing her damn diapers. She'll eyeing the shit out of her depends. Spray starts the whole nine. Hardest shit I've ever seen in my life. And she hated Mike Tyson. She hated Mike Tyson, couldn't stand him, no one knew why. I feel like she had like this personal vendetta on Mike Tyson. And her biggest goal in life before leaving this earth is with Mike Tyson's ass. <laughs> no one knew why, but I knew why. I found out. So I told my friend one day, I said, listen, um, my grandma, she hate Mike Tyson. She wanna whoop his ass. He didn't believe it, so I've been a five hundred dollars, right? So I decided to call my grandmother acting like Mike Tyson. <laughs> so I invited him over to my grandmother's house before she hit church. And we in another room, he's standing right next to me, right? And we see her in the living room standing right, right next to her telephone. I pull up my cell phone, dial the number, phone rings, she goes, uh, Hello? <laughs> yeah, can, can, I, can I speak to Jen? <laughs> this Jen? Who the hell is this? <laughs> it's me, Mike Tyson. <laughs> <laughs> I 
say, yeah, $500, bro. <laughs> no, I'll tell you what. While you stand there do all that talking, you meet me. I am Mike Tyson in the corner of 4th Avenue where you can show me what you can do. Oh, 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 I will show you what I'm going to do, Mike Tyson. Ooh, when I see you, Mike Tyson. Ooh, Jesus. Ooh, Jesus. I'm going to your ass, Mike Tyson. Right out the eye of my gun. My friend was like, what? I was like, oh, hell no, man. Not again. Hey, I'm Eric Queen Nelson. That's my tip. <laughs>